Hi, I'm Sean Fennell, Pioneer Product Economist for Southeast Nebraska, and I'm here at a dryland impact plot near Beatrice, Nebraska, and I'm taking a look at a new exciting hybrid that was commercialized for this year, which is P1548AM. This new 115-day Aquamax product has the agronomics that we need for this area, including exceptional drought tolerance, good gray leaf spot tolerance, and very good stability across all of our environments from dry land to irrigated, with very good late season plant health also. This is the third year that I've seen this product in impact plots, and this hybrid has been very consistent year to year, with good stress emergence observed, even in tough no-till conditions with heavy residue. As you can see here with the plant spacing consistency, along with the uniform stock diameter that you can see, you can get an idea of the consistency of emergence for P1548AM, even in an earlier planted location like this. Of course, setting residue managers appropriately is always very important in a no-till heavy residue field, but a product like this will help to be even more successful in this environment. Let's also preview what we can expect to see during harvest based on some observations from 2019 at an impact location that was exposed to multiple wind events and stock lodging up to 75% in some competitor products. At this top end yield irrigated location south of Hastings, Nebraska, we're looking at P1548 AM and how it looked on the day of harvest, October 26th. In the videos, what you will see are the outside rows of the impact plot. The inside four that are already harvested are the data rows. P1548 AM has nice late season plant intactness and also some stay green, which you can still see even at this location that had an early frost. You will also see the moderate ear placement as well. At this location in 2019, P1548 AM yielded 252 bushels per acre, which shows that this Aquamax hybrid also performs very well in high yield irrigated environments. You'll also find that this hybrid does have some ear flex as well. The ear on the right is representative of the type of flex that you could expect to see. So look for this hybrid this growing season and in plot results this fall. I really think you'll like what you see. Contact your local Pioneer sales professional for more details. Thank you for your time. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.